Hi, this is Dr. Donald Pelto, and uh, we're going to be doing a total nail avulsion today. If you look at this nail, it was a little bit infected. This patient's been on antibiotics. The redness has come down on the toe. Normally there was redness here. Very painful. And you see how this skin is kind of sloughing off? It's because it was very swollen, and now as the swelling comes down, that extra skin kind of sloughs off, very similar to like snake skin. And in order to do this procedure, we need to first use a little tourniquet. And this is put just to pr protect any of the bleeding in the area. And we test to make sure that there's no pain in the area. And a total nail avulsion is different than a partial. Uh, usually a partial, we take out one little edge of the toenail to relieve an ingrown toenail. But if you notice this nail, it can be lifted up and it's almost already off anyway. So for this type of a nail, where it was infected and painful, it's just easier to remove the whole nail. And that's what we're going to do today. It's, it's quite easy. You take a hemostat, you put it underneath the nail, and you just pull or twist. kind of comes off. And you see how it was kind of in the edge there, kind of like that. Now the area around the skin we want to remove as well. All this tissue, you see there's not much bleeding to the area. It's because of the tourniquet. That's going to, the bleeding will come back after. And this is all the, the tissue that's around the edge of it. And then you notice that in the sides of the nail, there's some buildup that we want to get out. We use a little curette for that to get all this buildup out of the edges. And that's how we remove a nail. Now I'll show you how to do the dressing. This is a dressing that we do for, for every type of nail procedure. It's, it's pretty much the same way. It's standard. We take a little uh, iodine, or betadine, we call it. Put a little bit of the iodine on my gauze take off my tourniquet, you'll see how the blood flow will return quite quickly to the area. Cover it up and then put on a couple of pieces of tape. This is removed tomorrow and it usually is best to take this off while soaking it in water or saline and that will allow it not to stick because occasionally it can stick and become a little painful. This is what we do for an ingrown toenail. It's better to go see a doctor sooner than later, especially with the infection, if you need to be on an antibiotic.